Yo, 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 what is good, YouTube family? And we're back with another one. And yo, all righty, man. Meet the Grams. Oh, first is Family Matters. Next is Meet the Grams. This shit is funny. This shit is funny. Um, so, like I said in my life, y'all saw the Drake joint. I said the only thing that I do know, or well, at least I saw on the internet. So, this supposedly was stolen was one of uh uh drake's pops uh suitcases or some shit like that and it was stolen and these are basically his stuff now how he got this i don't know but that's that's what that's what i've i've seen on the internet and shit like that because you know twitter gonna be twitter twittering and shit like that you feel me but that's what i know about this shit so this is crazy and you know what's ironic is uh, Drake said that Kendrick's pops got, got robbed. And then fucking, I guess, uh, Drake's pops got robbed. <laughs> it's fucking funny. But let's get the fuck into it, man. If you're new here, you just found my pretty face for the first time. How you doing? My name is Ace. We do reactions to all types of music, all types of genres, all types of everything. We loving this beef shit, man. This is the closest on some real shit. Me and my boy was talking about this shit. This is the closest that... My generation, because I'm 33, right? I'm Dominican and shit like that. So I came here to the U.S. when I was nine, right? So that's 1999, right? So I wasn't around for the... for I, I learned about it way later. So I wasn't around for the crazy Biggie and Pac shit. I wasn't around for the N.W.A. shit. I wasn't around for... Obviously, the Nas and Jay shit. You get what I'm saying? My real shit started with 50 and then going up from there. And then, obviously, I learned about other shit as, you know what I mean, I got older. So, like, being, this is the closest my generation gets to, like, a Nas and Jay beef. You get what I'm saying? So, and it's fucking, it's fucking dope because, like, this beef has been on and off for, like, I think, what, like, 10 years? Maybe a little bit less, maybe a little bit longer. So, like, so this is fire. You know what I mean? And I love it. I love it. So, if you're new here and you just found and you just, and you, you just stopped by and you're a first time or last time, yo, I appreciate you for stopping by and watching this video. But subscribe, hit that notification bell, smash that like button, and follow me on Instagram right there, right there, right there. All right, let's get to it, man. Let's see what he's talking on this one, man. Like I said on the last one, I got Kendrick right now winning. You know what I mean? So, but that last joint was straight fire. So, Kendrick, let's see what you're talking. Excuse me. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father. Let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man. You're My God, talking to his son. That's... That's Tupac level of disrespect, bro. That's crazy, bro. Dear Adonis, oh my lord, bro. That is wild. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father. Let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man. Your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom. I'm sorry that you got a grow. I kind of wish your grandfather would have wore a condom. Nah, Kendrick, you crazy. Nah, that's crazy. Then... Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father, let me be honest It takes a man to be a man, your dad is not responsive I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind him Life is hard, I know, the challenges always go beat us home Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown And you're a good kid that need good leadership Let me be your mentor, since your daddy don't teach you shit Never let a man piss on your legs, son Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son That's Never a fact. fall in the escort business 
That's a fact. There ain't no other man fucking peeing on me, bro. Yo, we dying together. I don't care how big you are. You could be fucking Debo. We dying together. We dying. Yo, I, I, I'll have... I, I, nah, that ain't never happening. That's... Yo, this is disrespectful, bro. Damn. I wish your grandpa would have wore a condom I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind them Life is hard, I know The challenges always go beat us home Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown And you're a good kid that need good leadership Let me be your mentor Since your daddy don't teach you shit Never let a man piss on your legs, son Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son Thanks. Never fall in the escort business That's bad religion Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches Never call Code switch, whether right or wrong. You're a black man, even if it don't benefit your goals. Do some push-ups, get some discipline. Don't cut them corners like your daddy did. Fuck what mm. Olympic did. Don't pay to play with them Brazilians. Get a gym membership. Understand mm. who's throwing rocks and This is what the fuck I'm talking about, bro. This is what I, this is what I'm talking about. Drake. Drake. Stop making hit fucking records for fucking for fucking disses. Stop making hit records. I need you to get disrespectful, bro. Nah, brother. Hold. Oh, nah, brother. He says, stop cutting corners. Don't go get a Brazilian. Get a gym membership. Even, oh, you're black. Even if it don't benefit you. Oh, my, bro. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. <sighs> Drake, bro. He talking. He talking, bro. He, yo, I ain't got nothing to say right now. In the head, son. Never fall in the escort business. That's bad religion. Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches. bitches. Never code switch, whether right or wrong. You're a black man, even if it don't benefit your goals. Do some push-ups, get some discipline. Don't cut them corners like your daddy did. Fuck what Ozempic did. Don't pay to play with them Brazilians. Get a gym membership. Understand, no throwing rocks and hiding hands. That's law. Don't be ashamed about who you with, that's how he treats your moms. Don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again, be sure. Five percent will comprehend. That's what that's where I kinda like I'm like 50-50. You know what I mean? Because like I said, bro, if I was as famous as Drake and Kendrick, y'all motherfuckers would never see my kid. Never. Never. Public figure, I don't give a fuck. None of y'all weirdos fucking seeing my kid, bro. You know the type of shit that be going on on the internet? Yeah, come on now. I that's why I'm just like, I'm just like, and also Drake said the same thing about him. He never really fucking posted a picture with his kid and shit like that either. But on some real shit, bro, Drake got forced into showing his kid. You know what I mean? He got forced. Like I said on the last video, I yo, if I would have had a, a kid with a fucking sex worker, I would have waited till Maury, fucking Jerry Springer. Fucking, P uh, 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 fucking my test, test results, like 15 test results came back, making sure that that's my kid. You know what I mean? And then still, y'all motherfuckers would have never seen it. You know what I mean? Y'all never would have seen my kid. Y'all would have seen him when he was fucking 12. You know what I'm saying? Or at least like 18 when he older. Like, damn, Ace had a kid? Yup. I never would have seen him. The fuck? That's why I'm just like 50, bro. Like, I, I mean, I'm 50 50 on it, bro. I, when you're a public figure, bro, there's so much shit that happens. Comments and shit like that. Like, fucking talk about... Y'all see how, how like, they be talking about the Kardashians' kids and all this other shit. Like, bro, like, I don't want my kid going through that shit and fucking him hearing it. Like, when he's fucking four, five, six years old, fucking talking about how ugly he looks. Y'all saw how fucking they would talk about Blue Ivy when she first came out, bro? That she looked like Jay-Z, ugly as fuck, this, that, and the third. And then now she's growing into her... Bro, like... You think I'm yeah, wildin'? Yeah, wildin' with that. Crazy. But this is disrespectful. Black man, even if it don't benefit your goals, do some push ups, get some discipline. Don't cut them corners like your daddy did. Fuck what Ozempic did. Don't pay to play with them Brazilians. Get a gym membership. Understand, no throwing rocks and hiding hands. That's law. Don't be ashamed about who you with. That's how he treats your moms. Don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again. Be sure. 5% will comprehend, but 95 is lost. Be proud of who you are. Your strength come from within. A lot of superstars, that's real. But your daddy ain't one of them. And you nothing like him. You'll carry yourself as king. Can't mm. understand me right now. Just play this when you 18. Mm. Crazy. 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 
dear Sandra, your son got some habits. I hope you. Now you going to the moms? Oh Lord, Lord, you going to the mom dukes? Kendrick, you a savage, bro. Dear Sandra, your son got some habits. I hope you don't undermine them. Especially with all the girls that's hurt inside this climate. You a woman, so you know how it feels to be in alignment. With emotions, hoping a man can see you and not be blinded. Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator. Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor. I think you should ask for more paper and more paper and more, uh, more paper. I'm blaming Crazy. you for all his gambling addictions, psychopath. So hold on, so he gave his mom just a quick little two cents and yo, this feels like he's literally in the room with them and fucking talking to them like a conversation like, you know, like parent teacher night, like he's the teacher and he's fucking talking about his, bro, excuse me, crazy, yo, this dude is fucking. Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor I think you should ask for more paper And more paper And more, uh, more Crazy. paper I'm blaming you for all his gambling addictions Psychopath intuition The man that like to play victim You raised a horrible fucking person The nerve for you, Dennis Sandra, sit down What I'm about to say is heavy Now listen <clears throat> Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts I think niggas like him should die <clears throat> And the wise thing should get fucked up in a cell for the rest they laugh he hates black women hypersexualize him with kinks of a nympho fetish grew facial hair because he understood being the beard just fit him better he got sex offenders on hovio that he because having a beard just fit don't come for the beards now bro don't come for the beards now yeah don't you you should, don't come for the beards now don't do that took me a while to grow my little patchy one don't don't come for it your son's a sick man with sick thoughts. I think niggas like him should die. Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest they laugh. He hates black women, hypersexualize him with kinks of a nympho fetish. Grew facial hair because he understood being the beard just fit him better. Crazy. He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance. And a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around him. And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking. Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose. I've Crazy. been in this industry 12 years. I'ma tell y'all one little secret. It's some weird shit. Going on, and some of these artists be here to police it. They be streaming, hunting victims all inside of their home and calling them tender. Then leak videos, set themselves to further push their agendas. To any woman that be playing this music, know that you're playing your sister. Or better yet, selling your niece to the weirdos, not the good ones. Cat Williams, I gave you the truth, so I'ma get mine. The embassy about to get raided too. It's only a matter of time. Hey, Lil Bron, he calling Drake a dead liar. He calling Drake the dead. Oh. Oh Lord, <laughs> his house is about to get raided too. Oh my God, yo, Kendrick, you are disrespectful. Bro, I love it though, but damn, damn, we gotta come up with a fucking uh, damn, the dr the 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 driddler, the driddler, damn. Set themselves to further push their agendas To any woman that be playing this music Know that you're playing your sister Or better yet selling your niece To the weirdos, not the good ones Cat Williams, I gave you the truth So I'ma get mine The embassy about to get ready too It's only a matter of time Praise. Hey, Lil Bron, keep the family away Hey, Curry, keep the family away To anybody that embody the love for their kids Keep the family away They Praise. looking at you too If you're standing by him Keep the family away I'm looking to shoot through Any pervert that lives Keep the family mm, safe That's 100 I'm looking to shit through any pervert that. That's hard. That's that's a bar. That's that's one hundred. That embody the love for their kids. Keep the family away. They looking at you too. If you standing by him, keep the family away. I'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives. Keep the family safe. Dear baby girl, I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world. He don't commit to much but his music, yeah, that's for sure. He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs. Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own. Should be teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you. Or at your 11th birthday. Baby girl, I'm 
I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world He don't commit to much but it's music, yeah that's for sure He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own Drake got a daughter? 11 years old? Damn! Like I said, I'm 50-50 on that one. You know what I mean? Like, what well, that type of business, that's his business. You know what I mean? It, that I, I really don't care. I don't count people's pockets, and I don't care how many kids they got. You know what I mean? I make that joke with some of my guys. If you went to DR, you probably have, like, two kids over there. You feel me? If you went there multiple years, you definitely got a few kids over there. You feel me? Um, But, or Brazil, or any type of fucking uh, <laughs> other place. But... Yeah, I'm 50 50 on that. So, like, if he does have a daughter, that's his business. You know what I mean? Hide it from the fucking world. I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? That's just me. That's just me. But, uh, because it shouldn't be anybody's business, you know? But, uh, is he not in her world? Yeah, that's different. Dear baby girl, I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world. He don't commit to much but it's music, yeah that's for sure He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own She'll be teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you Or at your 11th birthday singing poems with you Instead he being Turks, paying for sex and popping perks Examples that you don't deserve I wanna tell you that you're loved, you're brave, you're kind You got a gift to change the world and can change your father's mind Cause our children is the future, but he lives inside confusion Money's always been illusion, but that's the life he's used to His father probably didn't claim him neither History do repeats itself, sometimes it don't need a reason Crazy. But I would like to say it's not your fault that he's hiding another child Give him grace, this the reason I made Mr. Morale So mm. our babies like you can cope later Give you some confidence to go through something, it's hope later I never wanna hear you chasing man cause it's felt behavior Sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation You need to know that love is Thanks. Eternity and Trump's all pain. I tell you who your father is, just play this song when it rains. Yes, he's a hit maker, songwriter, superstar, right? And a fucking dead beat that should never say more life. Meet the grams. Yo, no lie. If like I said, it's none of my business. It's none of my business. But if he's not in his life, in her life, that's different. You know what I mean? And I agree with him one thousand percent. I don't want you to be with no sugar daddies and shit like Nah, that's wild. That, that's wild. A fucking dead beat that should never say more, more life. life. Meet the grams. Dear Harbor, I know you probably thinking of. Okay, this is this is straight to to RB Drake Graham. Meet the grams. Let's go. This is a this is a fire this. This is a this my guy really did a parent teaching night. Like, he legit did a parent-teacher night, talked to the whole family, and uh, and, uh, and and won an uh, allegation. That's wild, bro. If that's true, yo, if, like I said, it's none of my business, but if that's true because he's a public figure and he hasn't been in his baby girl's life, you know Twitter going to be tweeting. You know what I mean? You know, you know, yo, there's going to be detectives on Reddit and shit like that. You know what I mean? People going to find something. But, okay, let's go. Dear Harbor, I know you probably thinking I wanted to crash your party. But truthfully, I don't have a hating bone in my body. This supposed to be a good exhibition with... The it's Cap. You said it on the first record. You were the biggest hater. I hate the way you walk, the way that you talk, the way that you dress. I, you, you said it already. Dear Harbor, I know you probably thinking I wanted to crash your party, but truthfully I don't have a hating bone in my body. This supposed to be a good exhibition within the game, but you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name. Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people? Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you. And I like. I agree, one thousand percent. I one thousand percent, and. And I agree. Like, that's what I think happened. Like, what's the name? They probably, they probably was like, yo, we got some shit to get off our chest. This and third. J. Cole bowed out. He rode his bike and left. You know, <laughs> you know what I mean? He rode his bike and left. 
Then all of a sudden, once the first few tracks came out, J. Cole apologized and rode his bike even further. And then all of a sudden, they texted, yo, you shouldn't have did that. They texted back and forth. Fucking gloves came off. Now Kendrick really got personal. Now Drake has to... Drake got a little personal on the last one. But like I said, I need Drake to fucking take... Press the red button and, and do some shit. But... I, that's what I feel happen. You know what I'm saying? Because all these motherfuckers see each other, bro. You gotta remember this. All these motherfuckers see each other. They all fucking around. They, you know what I mean? They 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 all see each other. So there isn't. It's not. It's not gonna get personal. If it, I mean, it's not gonna get physical unless it's really getting there. But like I just said, he just confirmed it right there. This was supposed to be an exhibition, but what's in it? You name what you name dropped, and then now your son. Everybody's involved and shit like that. So. I mean, it's it's fair game. I I I understand that whole like hundred percent. Have a hating bone in my body. It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game, but you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name. Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people? Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you. And I like to understand, cause your house was never for a home. Thirty seven, but you showing up as a seven year old. You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping and spending problems, bad with money, horror house, soliciting women problems. Therapy's a lovely start. But I suggest some ayahuasca Strip the ego from the bottom I try to him I suggest ayahuasca also I've heard good things about that place in problems, bad with money, horror house, soliciting women problems Therapy's a lovely start But I suggest some ayahuasca Strip the ego from the bottom I try to empathize with you Cause I know that you ain't been through nothing Crave entitlement But wanna be like so bad that it's puzzling No dominance Let's recap moments when you didn't fit in No secret handshakes with your friend No culture cachet to binge Just disrespecting your mother Identities on the fence Don't know which family would love you The skin that you living in Is compromised and personas Can't channel your masculine Even when standing next to a woman You a body shamer You go hide them baby mamas ain't you You embarrassed of them That's not right That ain't how mama raised us take that mask off i want to see what's under them achievements mm. why well, believe you you never gave us nothing to believe in because you lied about religious views you lied about your surgery you lied about your accent and your past tense all is perjury you lied about your ghost riders you lied about your crew members they put extra emphasis on the fucking you lot oh my lord well yo that's 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 one thing i've oh i've never got because i've never been to canada right but I hear Canadians actually do talk about talk like that. But Drake just came out of nowhere with that accent. I, I, I think, when was it? During Views, if I'm not mistaken? Like around that time period around there when Views was coming out. Like all of a sudden he started talking like that. Like that UK slang and shit like that. Which I hear fucking Canadians do have. And like kind of like, you know what I mean? Tory Lanez even kind of talked like that at some points. But it never like was his image like he never really like took it like that so that is something i've always wondered because i've never been to canada so i don't know how they talk or even how some gangsters talk over there you get what i'm saying so that's always been one thing with me also like where, where the fuck did that accent come from? Do they really talk like that? You know? Mama's ain't you. You embarrassed of them. That's not right. That ain't how mama raised us. Take that mask off. I want to see what's under them achievements. Why well, believe you? You never gave us nothing to believe in. Because you lied about religious views. You lied about your surgery. You lied about your accent. And your past tense all is perjury. You lied about your ghost riders. You lied about your crew members. They all pussy. You lied on them. I know they all got you in them. You lied about your son. You lied about your daughter, huh? You lied Lied about them other kids that's out there hoping that you come. You lied about the only artist that can offer you some help. Fuck a rap battle. This a long life battle with yourself. Mm. That's crazy. Oh my god. Who the fuck is you? Who the fuck was that? Alright. Yo. <laughs> Yo. Yo, yo, Drake. Nah, I, I'm not even gonna cap to you, man. These last two, these last 24 hours, I'm not even gonna lie to you, man. Like, yo, he, 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 he's talking to you. He's talking to you. He, he, he's just putting out these records just so we can hear him with him. But he is talking 
to you, my guy. Yo, on some real shit. Yo, yeah, yo. Yo, as for this, incredible. This has to be one of the greatest. It has to be up there with no Vaseline, fucking who shot you. Fuck, it's got, it's got, it's, it's, it's up there. It's up there. Like, this was, bro, to have a parent-teacher conference with your fucking parents and you're 37 is crazy. Crazy. And to, yo, Drake, he, he killed, yo. As far as replayability, this doesn't have replayability to me. But as a diss, bro. Crazy. This is this is this is what we live for, bro. As hip hop heads, as as fucking like rap heads, as fuck all the pause. Yo, bro, like, yo, bro, this was crazy. Yo, Drake, t- press the fucking button twice. I need a fucking nuke. I need bring yo. Light skin boys is down right now, Drake. Light skin boys is down. Pause. Yo. Like, we need a nuke. We need a fucking nuke, brother. We need a nuke. This is, this is, this, 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 he killed you on this one, brother. I'm not even going to lie to you, bro. He killed you on this one. He, he's talking to you. He's talk. the last two tracks have been my favorite because he is talking to you, sunning you. Like, bro, I, I, we need a nuke. We need a nuke. Press that red button. And if there's a bigger button, press that. You because you know there's usually fucking. Uh, uh, you know what I mean? If you have a Ghost Rider, have him pressing one button, and you press the other one, Call of Duty style, to open the fucking doors to press the big button. We we need we need it. Like yo, we we need it, bro. Like bro, press it. I need Calabasas. I need I need something. I need something. You need you got it. You gotta give me something, brother. I need it. But yo. I don't care about my opinion, I care about y'all. Definitely let me know what y'all thought of this video. If y'all enjoyed this video and y'all new here, definitely, definitely, definitely hit that. Oh, hit that subscribe button, notification bell, smash that like button, and follow me on Instagram right there, right there, right there. Uh, let, yo, get into this discussion, bro. Let me know what y'all thought, bro. This shit is getting crazy. It's, it's really getting spicy. Uh, and, I, and I said that to a lot of people. I didn't think Drake was going to drop because since he dropped uh, 616, I thought he was going to wait maybe a week. And like respond to both or drop two, but he dropped and then he dropped and then Kendrick came back to back, bro. Like it is, it 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 is it, crazy. It's really getting spicy. It's, yo, yo, Drake, man. I need I need a bomb, bro. I need a bomb. I need a bomb. I'm a holler, child. Peace and love. See ya.